Hi everyone, I'm glad you're here. Thank you very much for joining me. It is Saturday, August 24th, 2024. There was over 204 reports of a fireball seen over, I believe, 13 states. It occurred Friday morning at 1.43 a.m. And reports included areas of Kentucky, Tennessee, Indiana, Alabama, Georgia, Illinois, Michigan, Missouri, North Carolina, Ohio, South Carolina, Virginia, and West Virginia. NASA says that the meteor was traveling at uh, 51,000 miles an hour, and its breakup created a sonic boom and that unleashed energy of about um, 10 tons of TNT, they said. And it weighed about 400 pounds and was about 20 inches across. Several videos and images were shared to AMS. This one here from an automobile isn't very bright, but it's right there. And then there's another one of um, a parking lot here. It actually lights up the ground. And another one from their nest doorbell. The whole sky lights up from this one. I think this video was probably the best. It actually breaks up right here. Here's an image of it as it comes into view. Let me play the real quick. Right there. Look at that. This report here says there was a terminal flash. The object went behind Roger Mountains and there was a flash of light from behind the mountain. Another report said it was yellow, light yellow, white, and there was a high-pitched screech. Um, delayed sound, yes. Um, it exploded at the end and it lit up a huge part of the sky, a yellow-orange in color. Another report from Indiana said it was light blue and green. They didn't hear the sound, um, but it was a um, very brilliant cayenne color uh, flash at the end, perhaps uh, brighter than the full moon. Another report says I wasn't facing the best angle, but it briefly lit up the night sky about as bright as a bolt of lightning. It was impossible to miss. And they have eight images or videos posted on AMS for um, this fireball event. There was also 74 reports, you can see right here, from multiple states. Um, early this morning, I believe it was. Over Louisiana, Iowa, Minnesota, uh, Wisconsin. And they have 16 photos of it breaking up. Look at that. And it looks like the trajectory was over... Uh, Wisconsin there. This report also has uh, reports of hearing a loud boom when it broke up and it was seen at 6 13 a.m. I might be wrong on the time but um, that's what I think it is. This report here says the final appearance was flickering like pops of white light before it went dark. I don't know if this is the uh, terminal explosion as I've never heard of them or that term before. The closest uh, report came from April in Black River Falls, Wisconsin and said the color was white um, it, and it was a large boom. Yeah, and she actually got to see it. Smoke trail, yeah. Large flash no fragments that they could see. Here it says the picture is the smoke after the flash that lasted uh, for some 15 minutes. The smoke stayed up in the air. Yeah, this image is sideways, but at least we got it, don't we? What else do we have here that they might have said the color was white? Here's another report with the image. You can see probably three different blasts as it disintegrated. And this one, I uh, don't know where it came from. Okay, let's just go down. Oh, Wisconsin. Okay. Um, color was white. They didn't hear, well, it says 
a concurring sound. Maybe like the other one said there was a whistle. Um, said it was a loud boom. A glowing train. Uh, flash was like um, a camera flash in your face. Very bright. So if you got some clear skies tonight, maybe you'd want to go out and watch for these uh, meteorites. Uh, yeah. Can you imagine? I bet you that would be very exciting. Many, many years ago, I saw a really bright one that lasted a long time. Um, yeah, something you would never forget. Did you see any of these uh, meteorites? There was also seven reports that came from New York, Ontario, Pennsylvania. Okay, let's take a look at that one, see if we got any images or anything. Oh, that was right on the border. Because it was all basically in the same location for these three different events. I wonder if they're from some larger body. Uh, yeah, because of the location where they impacted the Earth. Yeah, it makes you wonder. This report, too, said the color was also white. An awesome, strange experience. I've seen shooting stars before. I just watched uh, the Perseids, um a couple of weeks ago, and it was cloudy, but I saw one. That one was like a bright flash across the sky, and it went very fast. This one was quite different. It was much slower. It was more defined, like a specific point or object with a fire trail that I could see and watch as it fell to earth. My first reaction was that it was a man-made man -made object like a satellite. I stood there for a couple of minutes after it disappeared behind the trees uh, waiting for an explosion or shock wave. Um, yeah, I guess I didn't hear one. It was hard for my brain to accept that it didn't hit the ground. Um, a half a mile away and explode. Never experienced anything like this event. Yeah, it was white, but it did have a glowing train. Wider directly behind the fireball. And narrower to the point at the end. Maybe we should all get out tonight. Someplace dark. And watch and see if we can see anything falling from the skies. Yeah, it's that time of the season, right? <laughs> Stars falling from the sky. Cast out from heaven. Yeah, pretty amazing. So what are your thoughts? Put your comments down below. Thank you very much for watching. Please like, share, and subscribe. Have a great weekend. Be safe, and I'll talk to you later. God bless you. Bye.